So look, bro. Right here is another. T <laughs> Hold on, look. I promise you, I just got through from doing a beyond scare straight reaction right like ten seconds before I turned the camera back on. And that's what I'm. That she was, <laughs> bro. Hilarious. But look, <laughs> it's another George, <laughs> another Just Joe Brown video. I ain't did one of these in a minute because if y'all go watch like my last two or three Judge Joe Brown videos, I don't like how he be getting at his people, bro. He be disrespecting them. <coughs> he act like he on the streets arguing when he's really the judge and he, bro, we take his sides like that. The, look, they don't even be in court for two minutes and he already on the female side. Ain't listening to the dude like. That's why I really stopped messing with Judge Joe Brown. Like, what are you doing, bro? This is us. Like, you, me, and I'm. What, what the? Hey, go get my merch. Link in the description. I ain't got that shit on. It's like 1 o'clock in the morning. I ain't even, you know what I'm saying? But get over there and get that. And I'm going to drop a, look, I'm going to drop a song next week start. Just so I can't get it out, I'm just saying on the next video. This right here is uh Judge Joe Brown with that whatever. Let's go. Bad girls you love to hate today on Judge Joe Brown. We're back with Judge Joe Brown. The plaintiff in this case says he was studying with she a female dead. friend when his girlfriend accused him of cheating. He says he and the defendant broke up and then she slashed his tires and keyed his. This is what I don't get, bro. I promise you. I mean, it's probably just me. I can't go to no judge or on TV for a family dispute, my girlfriend dispute, whatever the case. I'm only going there if I'm trying to sue, like, the police. That's it. Or, like, the mayor or something. I ain't finna go there because somebody slashed my tire. You know how petty, broke, and stupid you look? You know what I'm saying? Well, they didn't want to pay me my $28. I needed that, so I took it to court. Yeah, you got up. You probably used gas to get there. Then you probably ate while you was there. Then you wasted time. All that is way more equivalent to $28 for your goddamn tire, nigga. <laughs> you. I'm about to prove a point. I want to take her to court. Nah, don't take it. Don't take me to court. Because, hey, I. Having a witness on you is scary. I don't care what nobody say. <laughs> if look, put it like this. Right now, if I stole some candy and the store clerk called me, I went to jail, cool. But now let's make another scenario. If I stole some candy, y'all know jail, you only doing like you ain't even going to be up in there three hours. You're going to bail out if you steal some candy. But like I said, a new scenario to where I steal some candy. And now I got a witness that seen me do it. Just the witness part make me want to do just. <laughs> finna have this thing going with the wind. <laughs> I probably just the witness part, bro. Even though I'm going to do two or three hours. Like, bro, you a witness? All right, bet. I bet you want to be a witness. Oh, right. Maybe I want to tell what I've seen here because asking. you would freak out. You couldn't no. understand. No, okay, he never, well, he never even tried. He never even tried. He didn't even well, try. Well, maybe you wouldn't be able to comprehend. Well, mm, yeah. You assume the pose. Let's see. <laughs> now he's a trash star, full athletic whoop, scholarship, whoop. Okay, and he whoop, will whoop. have. Why are you being disrespectful, though? It's what I don't like. When you up in court and you agree to go to court, um, put your court hat on. The judge up there talking, like I said, even though I don't like Judge Joe Brown and I don't respect him, a lot of people be like, I don't like him, but I respect what he's doing. Don't respect how he get down, bro. This, this is disrespectful. What he don't get most of the time is, you see how this female right here is, yeah, whatever, woo, woo. 
She being disrespectful. That's how they gonna be when they come in there. She probably ain't got no home training, whatever the case. She irate. People coming to the court drunk, high. They could all that type of shit. But what Judge Joe Brown do is let these regular defenders get him out of character when he's on the when he's the judge. You know what I'm saying? That's when he go in and want to disrespect them, disrespect their mamas, disrespect where they grew up. Like Judge Joe Brown is straight from the hood, bro. You do you Google Judge Joe Brown, he's straight from the hood and he be sitting on him. And that's the only thing I don't like about this fool. A Bachelor of Science, okay. I heard your remark over there, in electronic engineering from a four-year university. You are 20 mm. and unemployed. Mm. <laughs> Now. So you wouldn't even understand. Okay. <laughs> let me finish my story. She up You're there, just, just, she lost. What, how did all this happen? He right. just finna go in on okay. her. Okay, anyway. He finna I have been watching her. him for two days. The first day, he was just sitting in the car waiting at the campus. The second day was the day that he got caught. And caught doing what? Cheating. He was still with the girl. Well, you say you saw him come out of the dorm. Yes, he came out the dorm, and then a couple of minutes later, that's when she walks out talking about, why are you still here? Can't you see that he doesn't want to be with you? He already not rocking with her, bro. It's because of her attitude, like I said. The demeanor that these people come in, he judge you off the bat. Go look at his other, uh, go look at his other court cases. Even if you don't watch mine, bro. You look at them other court cases, you be like, what's wrong with bro? And then I end up reacting to a video to where Judge Joe Brown actually went to jail because he had to go to court one day. And he was up in court trying to tell the judge how to do his job. So the judge told him, like, bro, I respect you, but you better chill out. He's still woofing. So the judge that was in there uh, up in the court that he was at, like, Judge Joe Brown. Yeah, bailiff, take him to the back. Two days. He's like, I ain't going nowhere. Then he going to try to tell the judge. Well, I ain't paying this. I'm going to pay this amount. Like, bro, you ain't working today. Today, you was a civilian. You know what I'm saying? And you was at court, and I love how that judge handled me, bro. He's like, I don't care who you is. Stick it. Two days, bailiff, arrest him, get him out of there. This happened years ago. These videos I reacted to happens years ago. I reacted to it probably like two or three months ago, four months ago. Even though it happened years ago, I'm up here... Like, after I finished, I was driving, like, smiling on the way home, like, Judge Joe Brown finally got arrested. Like, this nigga been out. <laughs> I'm up here smiling some shit that done been, happened, uh, years done went by, he done probably smoked kush with the judge that locked him up. I don't, I don't care, bro. I be wanting, yeah. You, you don't like us, and we don't like you, because that's how you be acting, nigga. And you supposed to be team light skin. Oh, you tripping with you and that's when he looked me in my face and claimed the girl to be his girlfriend well he moved on he upgraded <laughs> okay well he should he upgraded. upgraded he upgraded here we go well that still is an excuse is that why he lied and that's why lied? he lied yeah lied you don't have any papers on him okay well he still lied he was with the girl so what so he lied maybe he's that's thinking why, about that's you why walk. his tires got slashed maybe and he was I enjoyed just the noise you know phew <laughs> yeah, maybe. Yeah, she a real one. She already know she ain't finna go to jail, bro. You gonna make me pay for these tires, cool? And I enjoyed the little sound. Ew. It look young ones, man. You gotta watch out for her. She a little feisty when she got a tongue pierced. She a little young freak that like to fight with bad attitude, but bomb in the uh. Hey, ghost. Shut up. <laughs> I'm almost, I can tell her type though. What was going yeah. on is, um, I, I, I fuck with it. And you I walk up in there and, there and start acting a fool. I sure and did. Says, I sure did. The other one says, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait a minute, wait, wait, wait. wait, 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 wait. Like Baby, you off. don't have time for this, this, this okay. hood rat over here. Got hood hand rat. on. See what I mean? Yeah, look. See what I mean? See what I mean? Call it straight a hood rat. This is what I be talking about, bro. Wait, 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 baby, you don't have time for this, this, this hood rat over here, got hood hand rat. on hip, yeah, look at hip, mm-hmm, <laughs> yeah, I did it, but he had it coming, that's that hood is. rat, see, that ain't no hood rat, no education, that ain't no hood rat, cause if that was a white girl said, mm-hmm, you wouldn't even call her that, you call her a hood rat cause you black, and that's what we do around the hood, when we see 
a thirsty female. She always got an attitude. She always talking over. We be like, she a rat, bro. And, and it's a rat, nigga. We don't even say hood rat no more. That's so 1993. Get 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 up today. Oh, she a rat, bro. Oh, she a hood rat. Niggas don't even say the hood part no more. That bitch is really it. Yeah. 1993. And ass, hand on hip, striking pose, head waggling, and got attitude about what? Hand Black on women. Hand. Lying. Black yeah, women. Your mama doing, doing, your sister doing, your cousin doing, your ex girl doing, your new. He's a senior getting ready to get his four year bachelor of science degree from a university and get big ducats. Okay. So he's got it. So somebody else with it says, uh, you can do better. And he's going, oh, yeah, I wish you'd come into life a little earlier. Uh. <laughs> Well, see, the other girl probably is a lot more intelligent and even tempered. I mean, look what we've got Listen going to him. on here. And I'm assuming at least she's a lot more intelligent because she's at court acting mad and irate at her boyfriend because they're in there over some tires. That's why she acting like that. You don't even know the other girl. You ain't heard her talk or speak. She could be more, way more getaway than her, so to speak. Way more irate. Way more belligerent. How, what, however you want to put it. But you ain't never seen her. You're going to automatically say, oh, yeah, he got a smart. You just disrespecting her, bro. Ain't got no respect for women. And she 20 years old. Why you doing her like that? You supposed to put her up on gag. You ain't supposed to be doing that. Okay, he got him another little girl uh, that you seen her with. Well, this is what you need to do, green shirt. Why don't you go get you a new dude since he moved on? You need to stop tripping on him. But instead, that's because she's smarter than you. You dumb little hood rat and you boom. I'll sock you, bro. Just though Brown be acting like able a... able to uh, figure out what she did uh, wrong. Uh, you don't seem to get the idea. Let's see the car. Uncle Tom. That's a, that's a, I promise you. Now, let's keep going. Now. He lucky he didn't get his windows busted, too. There you go. Why would he be lucky? Because I should have did more damage than that. Oh, you should have. Yes. Oh, my, that's awful. I look at it this way. Your damages in terms of repair, $1,709. Let's make it $1,700 and another $1,300 in punitive damages because no, she uh -uh. did it deliberately. No. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh Cause you up there acting like you just do not care. Yep, I should have did more. Yep, I should have. And you knowing that the judge ain't on your side. Oh, you you double worked up in there. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Hold on. You up? You know what I mean? Shit, you're double work. Uh uh. Uh huh. You finna pay all that too, or they gonna suspend your license? <laughs> ain't gonna lie, they gonna suspend your license. Yeah. See, that's what I call hood rat. That's being ignorant, and you're relying on trying to be fine. But you see, there are some very intelligent women that are doing some things with themselves other than being 20 and unemployed and acting like a hood rat. Okay, and I'm and not he a said, hood rat. oh, let me get an upgrade. Yeah. Uh, upgrade. <laughs> he got an upgrade. Senior. Just Joe Brown. She'll be next year. Whoop, junior whoop. now. Okay. Wait whoop, a minute. Whoop. In electronic engineering. And, whoop, whoop. and that's a hell and of a whoop, lot whoop. more advantageous to him. You don't even know the other girl, bro. Just Joe Brown can't be that stupid to where anybody knows that you can't judge a person off what's written on paper. You know what I'm saying? You just can't do that. If somebody, if right now I went to jail, yeah, I'd have called me a high one. Went to jail for murder. Seen dude like this Jays often. Boom. And then one of y'all Right now, dude smashing your sister. For years, you ain't doing nothing. Then you finally snap. Then you smoke him. On both of our papers, on both of our rap sheet, it's not going to explain that. Mine going to say murder, and yours going to say murder. But we two different type of niggas. You can't judge nobody off what you see on a piece of paper, bro. And he really going big for this girl he never seen, talked to. What? I can't rock with Judge Joe. I can't. Then so unemployed did. with hood rat attitude, talking about he lucky all I did is flatten all four tires. Sure did. 
And it's uh, going to cost another grand. The jurisdiction limit's 5000 so your recovery is going to be 4000 1700 and 2300 punitive. And, my dear, uh, this is binding, uh, and it supersedes any other applicable state circumstances. Man, we don't want to hear none of that. That's it. There's no appeal. Therefore, you've got 2,300 in punitive damages you're staring at for your ignorance. Now, you take it as a little. See what I mean? See what I mean? Lesson in enlightenment. Yeah, yeah. 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 Now you're giving him a shot of wisdom and understanding. Mm -hmm. I ain't got to put up with no hood rat. He just charged her a court fine. For being ignorant but you calling this woman a hood rat you calling her dumb you belittling her character this is a woman bro you ain't supposed to treat him like that i don't care and then this old buster right here i don't care if i am into it with my girl i bought her to court I'm not finna let this fool keep talking. I'm like, just chill out. I know I'm mad at her, but you're going in on my girl right now. I'm like, just chill out. He could have said something on that. Respect. Yeah. Yeah, I ain't. I'm, I, this, I don't know. When I can get fine and intelligent and on my side and knows what I'm talking about and is right there at 12 midnight understanding yeah. what the load's about yeah. rather than where are you? Uh-huh. You expect me to believe you working at midnight? Well, get ready for it. Look at got the hip position. Head on. Look Bro, yeah, yeah. your family member is just yeah. like that. Ain't you from get Oakland? Award, young man. Move on. Stay away from this type. You don't have yeah. to do that. Enjoy. <laughs> Thank you, Judge O'Brien. He worried about being funny on TV and having an audience. That's why your wife laugh at you. Laugh at that. Ha! You know what I'm saying? I'm going to catch y'all later, man. Rest in peace, King Nipsey. DJ Gups, one.